Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me Hannah here and thank you so much for joining me today. So today I am doing the um, wedding guest dresses video that I had mentioned in my last Shein haul. If you haven't watched my Shein haul, go check it out. I kind of had evening do dresses or like bachelorette hen party type style vibes in that. And today I am doing a wedding dress, wedding guest dresses haul from Simply Me. And I have ordered a lot of stuff. Um, so I've got some really, really nice dresses in here. You may have seen one of them on my Instagram. It's so super beautiful. Um, and when I tried these dresses on, I didn't wear heels with some of them. And then halfway through, I was like, oh my God, I need to wear heels. So some of them I'm wearing with heels in the try-on, some of them are not. I'll leave all of them linked in the description. Um, it seems like we always have like a cord off and stuff like that. I got these for, I think, 10% off, but they usually have 20% off. 25% off sometimes if you're lucky, 10% off all the time. So do keep an eye out, but let's get into it. The first thing though, I want to show you just a casual dress that I ordered for myself from there. So I'll start with that and then we'll get into the wedding guest dresses. What? Okay, yeah. So I got this in a size 20. Everything else was in a size 22 unless mentioned otherwise. I got this one in a size 20 because there was no other sizes and it's just a plain one for me for every day. And it's a dobby mesh dress, so I'll show you that, what it looks like. It's got a little frill on the sleeves, it's quite cute. <gasps> the sleeves inside out. You can tell I've tried these on, can't you? Um, it's got long, see-through dobby mesh sleeves, little frills on the shoulders, a tie at the neck, a stretchy waist, and then it's just got a little tear at the bottom. Really, really plain dress. It's okay. I mean, it's good for every day, good for work. Wear it with a pair of tights and boots, you're done, you know? So I got that for myself. This is in a size 20. Um, oops, everything's falling down. Sorry about all the crinkling. I'll try and edit this so there's no crinkling in it. I will try my best. But the thing is, I talk whilst I'm like opening the stuff and then I'm like, oh, if I cut it out and cut in my speech, I was like, so annoying. Anyway, so this, I'll insert a try and clip. It's just your bog standard. It's a little bit tight in the bust. Um, but it's just plain, size 20, really, really easy dress just to chuck on for work. Then one of the dresses, first dresses that I want to show you as a wedding dress, guest dress. Wedding dress, guest, what? Okay, um, as the first dress, okay, so the first dress. This is super cute, size 22. It is a square neck, summer vibes dress. I love this, I think it's really, really sweet. If you were going in the daytime, um, it's got little puff sleeves. It's quite a large neckline, like there is a little bit of cleavage here. So if you're not about that vibe, then this dress is probably not for you. Um, it's got a ruched back, so the back is a little bit stretchy. It's got like a ruched panel in the middle. And then this beautiful, beautiful neckline, which is like kind of like a sweetheart neckline, but kind of like a square neckline at the same time. It's really, really nice. Gorgeous shape. And then it's a long midi dress with one tier at the bottom. The pattern, the colours are really, really sweet on this. I think this would be really, really nice for a summer wedding. If somebody's having a wedding like in a, a marquee or garden or something, this is a really, really cute dress. You'll see in the trying as well. I think I've styled it on with... Have I tried this on with heels? I think I did. Um, but I just think the shape of this is really, really pretty. Um, and, you know, if you're not part of the wedding party, you don't like to go too dressed up to somebody else's wedding, you know. You like to still be in a gorgeous midi dress, but you don't want to be like, you know, it's my mum's wedding type vibe or something, my sister's wedding. So, um, so this is a really, really nice dress, a size 22. Um, I'll leave the prices down below as well if I remember what the prices are. Then I have a really nice dress. This pattern is beautiful. It just looks so ugly on me. And I'll explain to you why, but it's a gorgeous, gorgeous dress. Maybe I needed it in a size up, which is what I'm thinking. So let me show you. It is a V-neck dress. Again, this one has a little bit of cleavage with a tie back. But look at the colours in this, how sweet the sleeves are. Beautiful. It's got a little bit of shearing in the waist and you can see it kind of goes up to the bust. It's really, really gorgeous. The top half is beautiful. It's just... If you look at it, it's actually got, and I'll show you in the try, a seam right down the middle in the front. And it just makes it fall weird. Like it's right in the middle, that seam. And I don't know if I'm like twisting it, turning it to the side to make it kind of go towards one side. 
but it basically looks like the seam is right in the middle and when you look at it on the dress it is right in the middle of the shearing the seam and it gives it kind of a weird vibe so it is tiered all the way at the bottom it's beautiful super layered in terms of like it's got a lining it feels really nice and heavy very good quality and this also has a cheeky split as well which i thought that the seam was for the split but the seam is straight down the middle and then it kind of goes off to the side it just looks really really silly um so i don't know what the design of this dress is so it's going to be sending this one back but i just really love the pattern of this and this is i think one that i tried without heels but imagine this with a gorgeous pink strappy heel would look so beautiful or even with a lilac heel i've got a pair of lilac heels as well that would have been so nice with it um the quality of this dress is fantastic though it's super super heavy um and the pattern is just beautiful it's like these watercolor gorgeous flowers really soft looking as well if you're not looking for something that's like out there with bright colors this is a really really nice dress a really nice option then this is the one that i showed you on my instagram this is a little bit of a brighter option for those of you that like bright it's polka dot it's floral it's got loads of gorgeous vibes again a really short sleeve great for a summer wedding it's got quite a deep v um and then it's got shearing at just underneath the bust. This beautiful scallop kind of design, this kind of piping around it is really, really pretty. Um, a great quality, again, super, super heavy. Look at the pattern, it's polka dots with yellow flowers. Um, it's really, really pretty and blue flowers. I feel like this one is such a beautiful summer wedding dress. In the sunshine, this would be beautiful. So many of you said that you really like this. It was giving you summer vibes. And I think this one also has a split. Yeah, it does. So it's fully lined and then it has a split right at the bottom. And the split is not too high. So you're not like showing off your whole thigh, you know. It is really, really pretty. Um, and this one actually fits so nice as well. It looks really, really nice on. Got it in a size 22. Super thick fully lined like you would not need a blazer or anything for this like it's it's thick enough that it's going to keep you warm if there's like a bit of a gust a bit of a breeze but also um you know it's summery enough that you wouldn't need to wear anything with it this one is a gorgeous gorgeous keeper it's so nice i feel like it can go with anything and i think that i know i i, I think i i style this on with like a nude Valentino-ish type heel, one from my last Shein haul. So if you haven't watched that, then go and check it out. It's got all the heels I'm wearing in this that are in the last Shein haul. Um, but I feel like this with a pair of white strappy heels would be really nice. I need to go heel shopping, you know. I might do a video where I'm buying new heels. Because I got those three pairs from Shein, but I need some like actual a little bit bigger heels, you know, rather than the, the granny two inch heel that I'm used to. I did see a TikTok of a girl showing you how you can kind of get used to wearing heels, and like wearing the smaller ones, then getting used to bigger ones, bigger ones. So yeah, oh guys, my ring is just so beautiful. This one here, it's a new one. It says, be kind. I don't know if you can see that, but it's from Kurt Guy again. I'm so in love with it. My nails need doing, but it's Ramadan, so we're leaving it for now. Sorry about the crinkling. This one is a bit of a no-go for me just because of the length and the way that it fits me. Um, it's nice. It's just more casual than I thought. So when it came, I was like, oh, no, I thought it was going to be a different material. The material makes it super, super casual. It's like that stretchy crepe material. I don't think I'd wear this for a wedding. Um, it's just too casual. I'd wear this for work, you know. Um, it's like a puff sleeve type situation. Uh, a long midi dress. All of these are midi dresses long midi dress where the kind of the bust is i don't know how to explain this bust but it's like an empire waistline and then it's got a long kind of just a-line skirt this one is not wedding -y vibe i thought it would be but looking at it in real life it's just like a casual work dress so for me this isn't probably something i would wear for a wedding i mean new cord if you wanted to if you wore it with like i don't know pink strappy heels a pink bag or something and like a pink blazer over the shoulders that might be quite cute might be a vibe but i don't know uh, this kind of outlines my belly in a weird way as well so i'm not a big fan of this one it was one of the cheaper options as well but i don't know i just think this one is not for me i'll insert a clip of it but uh for me yeah it's a uh, no it was this size 22 yeah size 22 i'll leave all the links in the description for you so you can have a look at what that looks like then we've got this one for my ladies that don't like color that want black like me i really like this it's a slinky material this is my favorite type of material it's so flattering it's a slinky i don't know if you can 
here it is kind of kind of like a stretchy slinky jersey i really like it size 22 and it's just like not zebra print exactly but it is a printed dress and it's so super flattering there's somebody driving on a motorbike outside uh it's super super flattering um again it's that empire waistline and then a really long mid axi type dress but it's really flattering it hides all the lumps and bumps and then i put this on with a um that valentino ish heel but I probably won't wear it with that i'd probably wear it with a black belly there here or a black strappy up the leg heel because all of these are long enough that you can show a little bit of leg and still be modest um and wear it with a heel and it would be so good for a wedding and then i'd put a, a blazer over the shoulders for this dress because i just think it would make it look so fancy um so i really like the shape of this i feel like this would be really comfortable for a wedding as well this is my favorite dress but that's just because i wear black all the time you guys know and i'm wearing brown today but i usually wear black and you know i buy so many black things but i wanted to be a bit versatile so i really like that spotty dress love the first one which was a little picnicky blue uh, gingham dress and then this one i really really like this one this is so nice love the way that it looks the way that it fits i just feel like this would you could make it look so fancy and you won't have to just wear it for a wedding you could wear it for like dinner out or something but i think i'm going to keep this dress because i just feel like it'd be quite a versatile dress plus when i wore that dress all i was thinking about was a band tee a belt and using the bottom half as a skirt it just kept coming to my head i was like mm, 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 yes and then <laughs> the last dress let me show you so the last one unfortunately didn't fit me but i've still taken a video of it to show you it's a size 24 from chi chi london because i know that they're quite their sizing is really really bad um and this one is going to be going back because it's just too tight too small um so this is what it looks like it's got like that high empire neck neckline the pattern is just absolutely i think this is the nicest pattern from all of the dresses that i got most weddingy it's silky and i really really thought this was going to be a contender for a wedding that i've got coming up in august a really important wedding one of my friends is getting married and i thought this would be a great contender this with like a, a pale pink fascinator and like a strappy white heel i just thought it would be beautiful but unfortunately it just does not fit the whole belly outline is out everything is out and i don't even think going a size up to a 26 is going to help me it's got a zip on the back you don't have any stretch at all um, but I know that Chi Chi London sizes are not that great because I've ordered from them before and I've had to get 26 and it's like baggy up at the top, tight at the belly. So I don't know. Do you know what I mean? It's got a little split in the side. I just love this dress. I really, really like the pattern of it. And I really thought this was going to be a contender. So I feel like if you're a bit smaller, um, say you're a size, true size 20 maybe, this size 24 might look nice on you. Um, so yeah, so that is my, my last dress. So how many dresses did I show you? I don't know, six, seven? Couple of options, wedding dress, guest, because this is wedding dress guest, wedding guest dresses. This is the season um, for those weddings. So um, I hope you enjoyed this haul. I hope you enjoyed all of those dresses. Some of them are a little bit pricey, but that's simply be, to be fair, a lot of the quality is really, really good. So those ones with the multiple layers, really good quality. I love that zebra print one. Oh, beautiful that one is um so i leave everything linked down below please leave me a comment letting me know which dress you liked best which one you preferred thank you so much for your comments i love interacting with you guys i love waking up in the morning and seeing your comments and having a chat with you um in the um comments down below do follow my instagram it's hannah hearts x posting more kind of lifestyle outfits everyday type stuff on there millions of memes in the stories but let's not talk about it um and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video thanks a lot bye